Hello, 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 my name is JTams2 and you're watching a video where I'm going to present my suggestions and ideas for Minecraft. This is my personal ideas, so if you don't like them, criticize them correctly and don't just hate. So, here we go. The first thing I want to add is water textures. As you know, in every biome, Mojang has added different grass textures, so they don't look the same. But they don't have done that with the water. I mean, look at it, it's the same water in a desert biome, in a jungle biome, you know, you know like a river flowing through the jungle biome is like as blue as the one in a forest, and I don't think that that's a good thing. You know, the more the biomes vary, the more I think of an experience Minecraft is gonna be for the players picking the game up. And I mean, look at the possibilities, how the water can look, you know, having a river flowing through a jungle, that's... You know, you have the Amazon River right here, why not use that color of it? And the swamp biome can't have that blue feeling on the water, it, it's supposed to look dirty. And think of the ocean next to a jungle biome. That can look really awesome if you put some work into it. I mean, just look at the Florida Keys and the Central America, it's amazing. So give us water textures, please. Falling damage. When you fall, you take damage. And it doesn't matter if you fall on freaking concrete slash stone or if you fall on wheat or wool or glass, it's the same amount of damage and I think that sucks. I want to have, you know, if, you should take more damage if you fall on stone than if you fall on wool and maybe if you fall on glass, it, the glass should break if you fall with enough height. And the little I know Java tells me that you can't add values to the blocks because that will increase the memory needed for Minecraft and they don't want to do that. But why not use an already existing value, like the blast resistance value. Some blocks break easier than others and why not use that same value in determining how much damage you take when you fall up on blocks. And in 1.7 we got biomes, in 1.8 I want mobs to fill my biomes they are so plain now there's you know they can be more happening in them you know why have a savanna biome if you don't going to have a lions or zebras or giraffes and why have a swamp biome if you don't going to have frogs and alligators and crocodiles or whatever and mesa biomes can have coyotes and that would be really easy because you can just retexture the wolf and maybe the wolf and the coyote can breed and you can have other colors of the wolves, I guess. Like you have the horses and they can have abilities or something. That would be really interesting. And maybe butterflies for the flower plains. And some pretty ugly looking fishes for the deep ocean bios. They don't even have to make the mobs themselves if they don't want to. I mean, just look at this mod here, Atmos mob. There's... You know, just in the picture here, it's one, two, three, four, five mobs already done here. And since there are so many new biomes, there's there's so much space space for the mobs to you know roam around in. Just look at this buffalo here. He can just ro roam around in a plains biome and here. And I there's eagles in like mesa biomes, right? Oh, well, there's pretty much everywhere, but. And here with the stone beaches, they can they can be there the what are they called? Anyways, and they can like shit white things <laughs> on the stone cliffs. I don't know. I mean, and you probably is screaming to the screen ra right now. Why don't you just download this mod? Well, I I like to play it vanilla, and I don't like things to break, and I don't. I want to play my map for very long times, and I want to play on servers, and I. You get the drill. And, you know, there's so much space to add things in. I mean, look at these beavers, they would be perfect in in swamp biomes or forest biomes or, you know, a river flowing through a forest, the beavers would be perfect. And, you know, you know there's, there's space for the mobs, so I don't see why not add them now. And yes, I'm gonna be that boring guy that suggests a thing everybody already have suggested, but I want the wood items, the fences, the doors, and all those items to be in every wood color. Uh, you know, it annoys the crap out of me that they don't have that, and that's just 
trace frustration and things like that for all the players and it's not that hard to add and I don't see what it breaks to have that in the game. It may clog up the inventory a bit but I don't see that as a problem. So they had this easy way to get rid of some frustration in the game and I think those changes are good too even though they don't are really game changing but it makes less frustration in the world so why not? Okay, I may not know Java, but I don't see why Optifine isn't a part of Minecraft now. There might be some problems I can't understand, but as I see it now, every person that plays Minecraft is just waiting for Optifine to update, so I don't see why they like haven't approached them yet and you know make Optifine a part of Minecraft. And I'm sure that will be fine when the mod API comes out, but until then you can avoid a lot of frustration in a lot of human beings if you just make that a part of the game, essentially. So thank you for watching, that's my ideas, I have many more in my head, but that's for other episodes. I don't know if I'm going to continue this series, if people like it I certainly will, and maybe you can send in your ideas to Minecraft, or on Minecraft, to me and I will take up them in the next episode if there will be any. And if you like Minecraft you should go check out my Let's Play series, I have two of them, one on a server and one in single player. I spend a lot of time in the makings of these videos so you should go check them out if you like Minecraft. And or you like this style of editing, I have a glitch in series with this style of editing and if you like glitching and you like this style of editing, as I said you should go check that series out. That's all for me. So thank you for watching, have an amazing day now and go out and do something fun and you know, live the life as you want it to be lived. Thank you and goodbye. Thank you for watching. If you like this video and you like Minecraft, you should check out one of my two Let's Play series. I have them listed here on screen. I spend really much time in the makings of them, so yeah, you should go check them out. And or if you If you like this style of editing, you should go check out this series, it's me glitching through Pokemon, it's really cool. So if you like this style of editing and you like glitching, go check out that video. So, thank you for watching, bye! I spend really much time making the these Minecraft videos, so yeah. Please. Please, 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 please. A swamp biome. Why have a swamp biome? Why have a swamp biome? Why have a swamp biome? Swamp biome, a swamp biome. Why have a swamp biome? Why have a swamp biome if why have a swamp biome? Why have a swamp biome?